Well, this is regarding an oil spill that was spotted at Mumbai's Juhu Beach. It was first noticed yesterday, but uh, this morning's high tide, it became more prominent. The cleaning process by the Mumbai civic body is still on. The source of the oil spill is not mentioned by the Indian Coast Guard or any other marine authority so far. Those are the details here uh, at this point in time. This is an oil spill that has been spotted at Mumbai's Juhu Beach. Uh, it was first noticed yesterday but uh, it has become more prominent with the, the, this morning's high tide. Uh, now the cleaning process uh, is underway as well uh, and the source is yet not known. Santhya is joining us for more on this. Uh, Santhya, what can you tell us about how big this oil spill is and what we know so far about it? that it became prominent and let me show you some visuals and how uh, specifically those viewers who do not uh, uh, you know live near beaches and haven't uh, really been exposed to uh, an oil spill how does it look like so these are the traces of the spill uh, so this is uh, Juhu beach and the cleaning process is right now going on BMC is conducting the cleaning drive so with the help of tractors first uh, the spill uh, which is there on the shoreline uh, on the uh, beach sand that is being collected, you can see with the help of these tractors, there are around three tractors on this particular patch itself. First, the major content of the spill is being uh, collected, is being cleared. And after that, on uh, the other extreme of the uh, camera frame, you'll see that the BMC workers, the workers, team workers appointed by BMC, they are also there. So whatever remains are there after the spill, uh, the workers are collecting that. They are doing that manually. Uh, one dangerous thing is that Avni, all these workers are not even wearing gloves. Uh, most of them, they can't even, if, for example, one worker who is just, uh, you know, walking, you think he's not even wearing any shoes. So this is extremely dangerous. They are exposed to the spill, to oil spill, and just clearing it since hours now without even proper gloves and uh, footwear. So this is Juhu Beach where the spill has taken place. As I said, there are three tractors uh, which are uh, clearing the beach, talking about oil spill. As of now, we don't know whether uh, it came from uh, the offshore oil uh, processes and drilling which happens in uh, the Arabian Sea near Mumbai area. Uh, we don't know whether it was an accident. Mumbai area, uh, we don't know whether it was an accident. Uh, 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 this oil spill was whether it was a result of an accident of any uh, vessel carrying oil. What was the source of the leak? That we don't know as of now. But let me talk about the dangers of an oil spill specifically of this nature. See, uh, it's uh, it's monsoon area. So in Mumbai and specifically if I talk about coastal line in July and June, these two months, uh, fishing in the deep sea, uh, deep sea is not allowed. Allowed. It's only in August that uh, fishermen, they start fishing, but because uh, of heavy rains, they still don't go inside deep water. They depend on the shoreline and a little bit inside uh, the waters for the fishing. But with this oil spill, it has directly impacted uh, the fishermen community specifically of this region. And we all know what kind of impact oil spill has on the marine life as well, specifically uh, the fishes which are used uh, uh, by the... Uh, specifically the fishes which are used for commercial purposes because these kind of spills, they contaminate uh, fishes, prawns and other uh, sea, uh, sea life and as a result that of course uh, affects the fishing as well. So this is uh, as I said Juhu Beach, these are the traces of the spill and see till that extent, that's the other end of the beach, you can see the tractors are going till there and that's the stretch of the entire spill here. As of now only Juhu Beach is said to be contaminated uh, with the spill the entire shoreline of the city is not. Avni. All, all right, uh, Santhya, thank you so much for joining us uh, with all of those details and uh, showing us what the situation is on Juhu Beach at this point in time.